this is just a quick box of uh, a couple of boxes of Rani uh, Hindu incense, uh, scented incense, and the one is on the left here. That was at my dad's bar, and it has a copyright 1948 on it. On the other side, and the box, surprisingly enough, that looks uh, in better condition, is marked uh, 1934. Now that, I actually do have some uh, incense in there. There's the little mark there saying 1934. I hope that indicates a date. And right there is the back of the one that I grew up with. And there's uh, the uh, 1948 one. Now that one's empty, but the 1934 one, as I said, has some of the incense. Now I have no way of knowing if this is actually from 1934, but I know it's pretty old. And, uh, you know, if you open it up here, here's what they uh, looked like. This is the uh, jasmine scent. And they were like, you know, just like little cones like that. Now, the thing that fascinates me about this is they say that smell is like one of the most powerful things to bring back memories. Now, I wasn't alive in 1934. I was born in 1959. But it's still amazing to me that uh, lighting this, if this will light, uh, using one of my uh, giant uh, matches to light this, it's usually for a grill, it will actually, you know, when you think about it, the smell... If this is from 1934, it's probably, you know, much later, but I'm not sure how to date it. Like I said, that smell, when lit, uh, is actually a smell that was made, you know, in a vintage era. Oh, and boy, does that smell good. And when I turn the light off here, you can see that this, yes, this actually is burning. Well, thank you so much for watching this short video.